Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today on the show, we're taking a look at a video game haul. PS4 games, to be specifically. Uh, first, some of these games I bought a few months ago, sometime, even a year ago. I wanted to wait until I get got enough to do an actual haul for them. So, <clears throat> here we have... Batman Arkham Knight. Uh, I bought this. So let's go down a little bit. There we go. There we go. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, I bought this, uh, I believe, back in uh, October, November, somewhere around there. And just played it uh, a few weeks ago. Really liked it. I did not complete it completely, entirely. Um, I did not finish battling Deathstroke in the final battle. I also did not complete the Riddler challenges. Uh, I'm on the part of the Riddler challenges where you got to go through Riddler's course in the Batmobile within a certain amount of time. I'm not that skilled with the Batmobile, so I, I just, I can't, I, I can't get the, uh, Finish the course in time. I got all the way up to um, challenge three of that course, where it puts in different obstacles, more obstacles, and gives you a shorter time limit. So, uh, yeah. Up next, we have Watch Dogs. I have not played this game yet. Um, I've heard that it takes place in the same universe as Assassin's Creed. I'm a big Assassin's Creed fan. Uh, so I can't... And, of course, it is on sale for five bucks. So I can't wait to get started on it. Up next is Assassin's Creed Unity. I did complete this game last year. Uh, I've been playing it for a while. Uh, usually during my work season, I don't play video games because once I start a game... I become obsessed with it until I finish it or until I get to a part that just pisses me off enough that I don't want to go on anymore. <laughs> uh, but it is a good game. Uh, the, there was only one glitch that I found in it. Um, other than that, I thought it was a really good game. I know this game was the least favorite of all the Assassin's Creed games, but I really enjoyed it. Uh, we've also got Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Uh, I have not played it yet. I bought this the same time I bought Unity. Um, I just haven't gotten up, gotten around to playing it yet. Uh, I hope it's really good. Uh, I I've got a couple of the figures uh, from McFarland Toys, so I can't wait to play it. Uh, I've just bought this game last week, Assassin's Creed Origins. Uh, another game I can't wait to play. Uh, I had the choice between this and I believe it's a, the newest one, Assassin's Creed Spartan, whatever it is. I can't remember the exact name of it, but I chose Origin simply because I've been wanting to play it since it came out last year. Or two years ago, I guess it is, since it usually comes out around November or September, November, somewhere around there. Um, so yeah, I went ahead and got it. It was on sale. It was pre-owned. So it is like about 15 bucks, somewhere around there. Finally picked up brand new sealed in the box, Red Dead Redemption 2 special edition. Uh, I've been playing this. Uh, I have not played the story mode yet. I've been playing live. I went ahead and got a free trial of, uh, PlayStation Plus because you have to have PlayStation Plus in order to play online for whatever reason. I don't like that, but it is what it is. Uh, I'm really enjoying the game, so I may go ahead and and uh, purchase a subscription of PlayStation Plus um, and go from there. Inside the box, we'll go ahead and take a look here. Opens from the top. We have... First things first, it comes in a metal tin 
very nice. It also comes with a map of a portion of the United States. N.J. Worthingham, official limited, 1899. This is the same map that you use in the uh, in the game. It's a big poster map. I'm not going to open it all the way up. Uh, eventually, I will find a place to put it. Uh, inside, there's the front. Inside the tin, you get two cards with uh, codes on them. I turned them around because I have not typed in the codes yet. I don't want you guys stealing from me. Uh, you get a data disc and the gameplay disc. Uh, the data disc took about an hour to load. Uh, maybe a little bit more than an hour to load on the PS4. Uh, the game itself on uh, on online, um, it's really good. It's really good. Um, part I don't like is that it has a tendency to kick me off. Uh, probably two times per gameplay. Uh, I'll be getting into it or whatever, and then all of a sudden I'll get an error code and say that PlayStation Network uh, booted me or whatever. Uh, but usually that's within the first, first uh, 10, 15 minutes. Then after that, it, it plays okay. Um, I don't usually have problems with it after that, after those first two boots. Um, getting into it, I first starting to play it, I was learning about it and everything, and I kind of got into it with another player. Um, <laughs> it was not my intention to piss anyone off. Uh, however, apparently I did piss this one player off by shooting him, and he just continuously killed me. Um, uh, and then this other player, just out of nowhere, starts attacking me for no reason. Uh, he had a bandana over his face. Uh, he would tie me up with his lasso and set me on fire, which I thought was pretty cool. Uh, very demented. Uh, we'd, we'd kill each other on and off. Uh, but yeah, it's very great gameplay. You can hunt uh, animals. Uh, you can kill, shoot, kill other players. Uh, you can... It's not like... Uh, Red Dead 1 online where it's just you and the other players um, rather Red Dead 2 online when you're in free roam it's got you other players plus computer generated um, sorry you guys hear the train back there uh, computer generated characters um, so that you're not constantly only around other players sorry about that guys i had a phone call is one of those expiring auto warranty scam things I, I wish they would pass a law against those telemarketers i really do they're they're stupid uh they're just scams is what they are but anyway um you can kill the uh computer characters and uh just like in Assassin's Creed, you can steal anything they have. Uh, the only thing is, when you can when you kill other players, I don't think you can steal anything from them, uh, except maybe their horses. Uh, other than that, you know, it's a really great game. I'm really liking it. So there you have it, guys, on this PS4 video game haul. We had Red Dead Redemption 2, Assassin's Creed Origins, Assassin's Creed Syndicate, Assassin's Creed Unity, Watch Dogs, and Batman Arkham Knight. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Tune in again next time when we take a look at a movie haul. Take care, geeks. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you can stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, Make sure you check out one of these two playlists on the side. 
for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Comic Getting TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.